हेलो स्टूडेंट्स अब जो इसका बचा हुआ पार्ट है वो हम लोग करने जा रहे हैं यहां तक आई होप कि आप लोगों को समझ में आ गया होगा कि जब भी इस तरह का एक्सप्रेशन होता है एक तो रैशनल एक्सप्रेशन और ये इम्प्रोपर फॉर्म में है तो सबसे पहले इसको डिवाइड करके हम लोग इस तरह से वर्कआउट कर देते हैं ठीक है और फिर देखते हैं कि आज ये ये प्रॉब्लम कैसे सॉल्व होता है और ये इजी हो जाएगा और आप आसानी से इस इंटीग्रम को सॉल्व कर सकते हैं ठीक है नाउ यू कैन सी दिस इज इक्वल इंटीग्रेशन यू कैन हियर हियर देयर आर टू टर्म्स सो यू कैन डिवाइड दिस टू टर्म्स by x plus 2 we can write x square minus 2x plus 4 into x plus 2 divided by x plus 2 minus a upon x plus 2 and this is the integration with respect to x here this term is common that's why we can cancel out this term and the remaining term is x square minus 2x plus 4 minus 8 upon x plus 2 and the integration of this with respect to this now you can integrate you can use the formula what is the what is the integration of x square it is x cube upon 3 minus 2 x x square by 2 Plus 4 should be constant. That's why it is 4x minus integration of this minus 8 is constant. So you can take uh, take it outside the integration sign. And the remaining term you can write integration of 1 by x plus 2 with respect to x. Here x cube upon 3 minus x square plus 4x minus 8. Here 1 by linear expression. Linear expression you can treat as one by x. If here is one by x, you can write its integration ln mod x. Similarly, you can write its integration ln mod x plus two. And lastly, the constant term c. Here we write a note. Note integration of one upon a x plus b with respect to x. You can write this formula. You can write the integral of this integral, ln mod a x plus b plus constant term c. But you must have to remember that if there is a linear expression and this is a x plus b, when you integrate this term, always write the coefficient of x in the denominator of the integral. Here the coefficient of x is a. x का ऑप्शन कितना है a है इसलिए आंसर में यहां पर 1 by a means a से आपको डिवाइड करना पड़ेगा दिस इज द फार्मूला एंड यूज दिस फार्मूला वी कैन यूज दिस फार्मूला हियर बट हियर द कोफिशिएंट ऑफ x इज 1 सो वी कैन नॉट राइट 1 बाय 1 बिकॉज़ 1 बाय 1 इज 1 सो इट इज नॉट नेसेसरी टू राइट 1 बाय 1 हियर बट इट इज इट 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 एग्जिस्ट and this is the final answer hello guys i hope you understand the solutions of the given integral likewise you can also solve the problems of this type you can uh, take your uh, test books and uh, turn your pages you will get lots of problems involve uh, this types of integral you can easily solve this and enjoy indefinitely now we have three questions more the question number 8 evaluation I is equal to integration of x square upon x square plus five with respect to x. 
here you can see this c this is also a rational expression here the degree of numerator is 2 and the degree of numerator numerator is 2 and the degree of denominator is 2 you can also divide this but we can't we but here we can't divide here we use a trick you can also use these types of trick whenever you use but if you see this type of expression you can use trick x square here it is x square plus 5 so we can write x square plus 5 we, we, we write plus 5 extra so we we'll, we we have to manage so we subtract minus 5 and this is divided by x square plus 5 Now you can separate this. X square plus five divided by x square plus five minus five upon x square plus five equals five plus. This is this will be cancelled out and becomes one minus five by x square plus five. Here five we can write five the square root of five to the power two. There is the square of the square. Root. It becomes five here. Integrate separately. One is constant, so integration is x minus five by something. Five is a constant. You can take out five outside the out of, outside the integral sign and write one by x to the x square plus the square root of five ka whole square. Now you can use the formula of this x square plus one, but here is x square plus a square. So the formula is. X minus five into one by a. Here a a square. Here a is root five. Ten inverse x by a. x means x or a means root five plus constant terms. So you can also simplify this. X minus square root of five. Ten inverse x by a square root of five plus constant terms c. Here we also write a note. Note. integration of integration of 1 upon x square plus a square the answer is 1 by a tan inverse x by a plus constant term c you can use this formula this is so simple you can use this way you you uh, you deal with this problem by dividing it and the answer will be same but uh, if we use this trick uh, why should we define this so we use trick when you are you see uh, this type of problem you can use this type of trick and it will uh, save your time it will save your time it is uh, good for us good for me and good for you Now we are going to the next problem. And the next problem is you see question number 9 evaluation i is equal to integration of 5 to the power log x base e with respect Before move move further, we use a formula which is uh, which has read in logarithm. Uh, you also know that we have we have five to the power log x base e is equal to x to the power log five base e means five and x interchange. Interchange and this is the formula in logarithmic chain. The property of logarithm. There are ten properties in logarithm which you have already already uh, know. And here is the one you have to use this. You can write this like this and use this formula to here. And this is equal to x to the power log pi base e with respect to x. Here you can see that this this is like as a constant. You can treat as n x to the power. N. So you can use the formula of integration x to the power. N. That's why the answer becomes x to the power 
log i base e plus 1 divided by log i base e plus 1 plus constant term c and do the final answer. So this is not a difficult problem. If you know this formula, this becomes very easy and you can easily integrate this integral. It is not a very uh, tough question or very difficult problem. It is a very simple question. If you know this formula, you can easily evaluate this. So simple, you can see this, you can observe this. So the last question number 10 of this exercise. Number 10. Evaluate evaluation i is equal to integration of 2 to the power log x base code base code with respect to x. Here we can also use another formula of logarithm. Here twice of 2 to the power log x base 4. Here the base of the logarithm is 4. So we can write 2 log x base 4. You can write 4 is equal to 2 to the power. And we know that the power of base becomes outside in the division form. This is equal to 2 to the power 1 by 2 and log base 2 or here it is x. You can also take this half into the power of x. So you can write 2 to the power log this is root x is equal to 2. And, and you can also use the formula of logarithm this is equal to simply root x. Since we know that x to the power log n base x is equal to n. You can use this. So for this complicated expression this becomes a simple expression, this becomes root x. So you can directly use this in terms of this. So this is equal to root x with respect to x. And you can use the formula x to the power n. Here n is 1 half. So answer will be x to the power half plus 1 divided by half plus 1 plus constant term c. Here x to the power 3 by 2 divided by 3 by 2 constant term c. That's why the answer will be 3 x to the power 3 by 2 plus divided by 2 plus constant term c. And there is a final answer. So guys, so friends and students, you really enjoy this, the way of expression, the way of uh, describing the integra integ uh, integrations. I hope you uh, enjoy by uh, seeing my video, my lecture and uh, um, I think it will be very helpful to you uh, for your uh, course and for your upcoming exam and uh, if you really enjoy uh, uh, this video please uh, like, share and comment and subscribe my youtube channel and you have already uh, uh, see that uh, this is the second lecture uh, problem discussion. So, thank you.